Hey everyone, what's going on? We are live at the 2023 Tampa RV Show, aka the Florida RV Super mm -hmm. Show. It is a day before this opens to the public, uh, and we want to show you what's going on. Is this the convention center? The Expo Center. The Expo this Center. Is so exciting. So this exciting. is where they have all the really nice RVs. Not that there's nice RVs in the other areas. But these there are, are the higher these end. Are super higher mm -hmm. end. So if you're new to coming here, we want to, what can you expect? So, so when you come into the Expo Center, you're going to have different sections. So right now we're standing in the Prevo section. So you're going to have um, Liberty Coach um, right when you enter over there. Then you're going to have your Emerald Coaches followed by your Featherlight Coaches. And then you have then, the Prevo Shell. Correct, which is, if you haven't seen that, you really should. It's very cool. Strip see, that see shell. See the quality yep. of those Prevos. Then you're going to have Marathon right here followed by uh, Millennium. Now, Millennium this year does not have, it's not a completed coach, it's going to be a shell of a coach. We actually did a video like this last year, from last year's yep. uh, show. So, but it's, it's cool to see, again, when you see the shells of these Prevos, you see why they cost so much. Correct, yeah. When you See, when you go to the other RVs, they're finished, everything is, is hidden, you don't see the structure it's it's quite impressive if you, if you have a chance to go into either the millennium or the prevo planed out shell go check them out and i know somebody's going to say is newell there and yes they are and as as last year the newells i guess they were naughty and they were they're in time out <laughs> no they're outside um right outside the expo center so there is one newell here so to immediately to the <clears throat> left of us walking toward the exit is going to be uh pleasure way and some of these are open. We'll just kind of quickly, you know, go through each one of them. Not each one of them, a few of them. Here's lights. This one's lit yeah, up. Yeah, so here. we'll go through one of the lights. So here's a pleasure way. There's no uh, show prices at this point because the show is, has it's, not opened. Yes, it's so this, early. this is the 23 Plateau TS. Mm -hmm. quick, you want to take this? We'll just quickly yeah. give you a quick. Okay, so here's the cab. These are super popular, guys. The Very B market popular. is extremely popular. Here's all your, your controls there. Okay, you're going to. Walk right into the I, I wet bath. Like this, actually. You like this one? Yeah, I do. Here's your wet bath. I mean, there's no slides. They're super tiny, but they do I have know. their purpose. Because there's a mirror. <laughs> there's not a lot of real estate they take up. Right, right. I do like the bees too. Um, here's your kitchen. You got a lot of prep space here. There's an induction cooktop, and then this is going to be your seating and sleeping area. All right. So you've got a couch here and eating area as well, actually. And here's one TV. You do have you have a push to open doors here. Okay. Um, and you have plenty of storage. Okay, here's some of here's your wine guard, your resets for your microwave, and the and the cabinets go all the way around. So plenty of storage, and you also have a lot of storage underneath. Here's a couple of 110 outlets for you. Here's a a, a la Airstream openings there. Okay, so nice wooden drawers there for you. Let me just close this. There we go. All right, moving all right. on. So we're not going to go in every single one because we'll be here for hours. We will be doing multiple live streams throughout this show. So yes. you want to make sure to subscribe, notification bell, follow us on social media because that's where we're going to be making live announcements uh, throughout different parts of the show. There's, there's a lot going on here. Right. And actually, if you're watching this, guys, there has been a change in our meetups. <laughs> okay. So now we've put a video out last night about this, um, but there's a little change. So as we're walking, we might as well just... Yeah, them in here, we got right? a couple phone calls from you know Liquid Spring. They they were able to secure a spot. Uh, so you you the one that knows the right. details. So I just show up. Here here <laughs> is the final so far for our meet and greets. So on Thursday at 12 p.m. to 1 p.m. we will be right outside the Liquid Spring booth. Just go to the Liquid Spring booth and we'll be right in that area. Well, no, we're going to be outside the building. Right, right. right. But it's but their booth is right near Correct. the exit. They're so going to have kinda... their uh, trucks with their lifts on them. Right. So you'll, you'll see us right there. Yeah. And then on Friday from 12 to 1, most likely, stay tuned, we will be with Intech. So Intech is going to be right actually in the same area by the the barn You'll expo yep. kind of you know area. Um, it was originally supposed to be at Battleborn, but we can't be inside. Mm -hmm. Battleborn will be there though, so if you have any questions about Battleborn batteries, they'd be happy to answer those for you. And then we're still doing the one by show holder. Are we still doing that? We're not doing that. Okay, we're not no, doing see, that. All right, see, no. that's why I just show up. No, because Liquid Spring now worked out. See, we're having this conversation right in front of you. <laughs> but yeah, so Thursday at 12, Liquid Spring, Friday at 12, by Intel. Perfect, so let's, let's do another one here. Uh, I'll go quickly through this one on okay. tour. 
2.0. The other one that we showed you, the Plateau TS, was on the Mercedes chassis. This is on the Ford chassis, so it was going to be significantly less expensive for sure. I don't know if we're both going to fit in there, hon. Yeah, we will. Okay. You're talking you want one. We better fit in here. <laughs> oh, I don't want one. You do. <laughs> so here's the, uh, the cockpit, and then we'll quickly just show you the bathroom, the fridge. Mini fridge. Oh, look at the little veggie drawers. It's okay. Oh, the mini veggies. I'm breaking stuff you already. The foam. <laughs> I do okay. like that it has the induction cooktop. I do like that it has. You got your wet bath there. That's a nice size bath too. Here's I a like little that. wardrobe, and here's your, uh, your table. So we're not editing these guys. So you know, if you feel it necessary to leave a comment that you know there's no editing, it's for a reason. Yeah, because this is a <laughs> premiere. We just want you to feel get a feel for the show before it begins. So we're gonna leave the pleasure way area. You know, they have plenty of RVs here, of vans, and then we're gonna head over to the Airstream, which is a huge display. Huge, they have tons of trailers, tons of motorized. So the, the pleasure ways are so Grisettis. That's the dealership that's representing them. Grisettis, okay. Grisettis, I said it right? Grisettis. Okay, Grisettis. <laughs> RV1 always has a huge following here. They're going to have uh, Airstream inside as well as four travel. The four mm -hmm. travels aren't open. Oh, I think we may see tile four right here. <laughs> Maybe he'll open them. You wanna go talk yeah, to him and I'll take people uh, over here. Just, your mic is on, okay? Okay. <laughs> so let's go over through the Airstreams while MJ goes tries to uh, cut a deal out there. So we have a flying cloud here. Uh, what's good about the inside is that there's power here, which is great. So quickly inside on the flying cloud. I always love the Airstreams. You have a little corner bed here with a bunk, which is kind of awesome. And then you have another queen size bed up front, up front. Really, really nice. So that is the flying cloud. I'm not sure the size. I don't want to open the door there. We're good. Okay, let's uh, let's let me just do the he's, base camp and then we'll we'll he's walk away. opening that up for us. Yeah, I see it's open. Let's see. Oh, okay, cool. He's finished up. So here's the base camp okay. X. See, I like the airstreams. I do. And you hated airstreams. This is like reminds me of Intech. I didn't hate. You're like they're so airstreams. Plain. They're so like. Ugh. Yeah. But this is interesting, huh? Yeah. But you have a, a large area here to to sit and this, this feels no, very large can you just it does, open that it does feel uh, bathroom there yeah yeah i, I okay. could do this i could tow this behind the, the truck no, yeah do that. all right good we're getting one <laughs> so that is the base camp all right let's head over to okay. for travel uh let's just let's go around the back real quick okay over there go right through i'm saying so oh, we'll okay. start around okay. the back part Thank you guys so much. Oh, you're very welcome. How Thank are you. you. It's good to see you again. <laughs> How are you guys? How are you? Want to say hi to everybody? Come visit you guys. Great this is coming you. out tomorrow. Nice to meet you. Brax, nice to meet you. Izzy, nice to meet nice you. Nice to meet you. All right. So let's start to on the back here. Of course, Ford Travel is always a big step. Do you want to tell? Do you, nice. you want to tell anybody that? I mean, you know it better than us. Yeah, absolutely. <laughs> so this, this is our uh, Show Coach 2024 model. Um, as you can see, it is a new cap as compared to the rest mm -hmm. of these. These are all 2023 models. And uh, we did do a black stainless package all the way okay. around this coach. I see the black wheels. That's, that's big now. Black wheels. So, so we went uh, pretty Beautiful. bold with this coach. So as you walk inside, it'll be a majesty interior. Mm -hmm. um, but yeah, if you all have any questions, let me know. Yeah, right. nice. thank do you. A quick walk around. Yeah, do a walk around. Let's go uh, the rear here. This is a presidential so you, series so around. A, a 24 which is nice. Look at the side of the did, camera did, in the rear. Oh, it's huge. Did you see the LED lights in the windows? Yeah, you love Be that. I love they just have to give lights to MJ's soul. <laughs> <laughs> and then one of the things, these are on the, I believe this is on the K4 chassis. It comes with standard, of course, side mount the radiator, radiator, fire suppression. It has the uh, the wheel blowout protection up front. That's right? all standard on the Look at how drive. awesome those are. They just I want to black my wheels. I, know. I want to black them out. I've already looked at them, hon. So do it. I've looked at the price. You know what's cool with the paint? Look at this. You see these? The ghosting? Yeah. I like it. And then another thing. Here's your uh, egress door here. Egress okay. door. Another thing, if you notice the slides, these all uh, air pneumonic 
uh, seals and they go all the way into the flush. So and, right, and then also on, on on these higher end, the paint is always going to continue Correct. around. Yeah. This is this is over a million dollars slide. for sure. Yep. So this is the driver's Ooh, side. Look at this. Yeah, the more of that like marbling ghost thing. Beautiful. We'll see what they did inside. I'm so excited, guys. We're seeing this for the first time with you. So look at the LEDs MJ was talking about. Yeah. Sold. <laughs> I'm like, you know, like when I'm, if I go into a shoe store, if there's black shoes with sparkles, I'm there. <laughs> it just pulls me in. I'll go inside. Beautiful. I'm just gonna get the front right here for Travel Realm, presidential series, see all LED accents. You have the lane mitigation up front, 360 camera, the chrome bus style mirrors. This step also, this will uh, this is beautiful into the body here with the chromed out finish. So let's go right inside, before we go inside, all keyless entry, door is finished out, of course, you expect that in something of this caliber, and this is really nice. This is beautiful, and it, especially with the L-shaped couch, it feels like home. It feels oh, like a you home. you smell that? I do smell it. it smells yeah, as soon as you walk in, it's, it's this gorgeous, right. gorgeous smell. Let me just get the cockpit oh real quick okay. while you explore. So Spartan K4 chassis, Again, there's the lane mitigation, your cockpit, everything you need, tile floors, no carpet, of course. That floor will drop down, or actually go up when the slides come in. Heated floors, it has everything that you're gonna want in here. Your so controls you have your are on controls a tablet. On a, yep, which is beautiful, it's a Garmin. Um, I love that. And then this is gonna be a drop down television, yep. just so you know. So you have one there, and then you have one over above the couch. Obviously, you would need another one because you're not gonna crane your I mean, head around. Yeah, like really, who could do that? Look at look at the size of the windows here, okay? And they're all beautifully outlined with the LED lights, as I mentioned before. And you up here, you have all your LEDs just outlining everything. Here's your infinity lights, which I love, with this gorgeous, gorgeous, um, you know, like a, what's the word I'm looking for? Finish? No. <laughs> Um, Leather, not padded, I, I, I'm losing the word here. So <laughs> here you have a booth with a little added um, room there on that one, which is nice. Plenty of cabinet space and they're all, they have like your little, you know, your carpeted, some divider, some dividers. And these are like a European style uh, finish with the like kind of curved, which mm -hmm, is nice. Mm -hmm. There's a lot of curvature in here. You'll see it um, up if you turn around behind you, right up. Right, here you see there's curves there there's curves in the cabinets there's curves here you know you'll see this okay so here's your uh, induction like a recessed induction beautiful place to keep hashtag stuff right mm -hmm. you can keep spices up there you can keep anything um this is beautiful here's another uh tablet that looks like that's part of the navigation also says garmin yeah that well the tablet wrong. was garmin okay so here's your wine chiller for you, those of you that like to drink, mm -hmm. which is nice. Whoops. And you've got some some deep, deep drawers here. You know, we're not going to open everything, but just give you so a look. The refrigerator. Here's beautiful French door fridge. Then you get, this is interesting, this is so look, you have a bunkhouse, which is gorgeous. Which will tighten, um, kind of tighten everything up. You see and, that, You yeah. can get these floor plans to how you want How you want them. it, right. Okay. Very cool door on the, uh, this is your half bath. Uh, you just locked me out. Let me go into the other side. So that is going to kind of close off. Oh God! <laughs> close off the, uh, you know, the sleeping from the uh, the main living area. So here's your your half bath. Look at the shower. It's gorgeous. There's a lock here. Oh, I can't. Okay, I'm not gonna. Whatever. You you can see inside, and now I can't even get it back in. You want to do that for me? I'll hold yeah, it. Hold on. Yeah, give them a tour of the rest. I'll, I'll fix okay. your, I'll fix your mess here. Thank you, darling. <laughs> oh, a huge window so you can go to the bathroom and look outside. Love it. Okay, so in the bunk area here, so you have, you'll see, you have. There's. Is that like a dog crate? Sleeping at, no. Oh, that's an asleep? actual. That's an actual. <laughs> that's that's where you would go if you misbehave. Yeah, I think I would get a little claustrophobic yeah. in there. It's for a really small. But child. uh, but yes, <laughs> very small. All right, let's move into. Oh my God, look at this picture. Would you look at that picture? Look at that little face. <laughs> <laughs> um, then you're gonna have your two uh, wardrobes, his and her wardrobes. You're gonna grab that one open, and they have drawers here. Okay, you see that? Um, this is a beautiful decor here. Is you're gonna be your TV 
on your televator. The enormous huge window. Huge window. It's pretty awesome. Huge. Here's your king size bed. Ooh, and you'll like see it is um, it's a space saver for they you. I like this here. Let me, I am, let, me, let me do this. I am going to like it. Yeah. Okay. So check this Ooh, out, so guys. Excited. You don't see this often. Right. Oh, it's a tub. One one. One it's a bathtub. Although no, no. I, not only is it a bathtub, there's a TV. Yes. Well, we've seen that. They've done. Yeah. We've seen that before. Um, that bathtub wouldn't really fit me. Uh, I'm, you'd have to curl I'm your five legs. Because I'm 5'9", I'd curl my legs. Yeah, but if you, if you have a kid, well, think about it. You know, you have a bunkhouse. You mm -hmm. probably are traveling with kids. And then there's your bathtub. Okay, here's a Closet, wardrobe. LEDs, there's egress door, This sink, will be your laundry. Washer. That's probably a, is that a combo? Uh, I believe it's a okay. Well, no, there's you probably space put, to put yeah. another one up top. Okay. And then you have your uh, mirror right here. Large medicine cabinet. You push in and, oh, there you go. Okay. Is it safe? safe in the back? If you didn't Except watch our gun video, you should watch that because we talk about having a safe in an RV. And since these are made in Texas, I'm sure there's a lot of gun owners that uh, would appreciate that. But you see the beautiful flooring as we walk out. So there's no price listed on this yet, um, but it probably is in the one point. It, it will probably be over a million you know, dollars, yeah, at least MSRP. Right. These are available through RV1. Uh, I believe down in Florida, RV1 has, and I definitely in Texas, uh, their affiliates of RV1 have them. So we're done with this one. Let's go to a couple of Airstreams. Again, guys, we thank you for joining us here. Uh, if you're not subscribed and have the notification bell, we really do encourage you to do that. Actually, I'm going to close this door. Because uh, you'll know when we go live, in different sections of the show, which is going to be uh, pretty exciting. There's a lot of uh, cool RVs that are out here. So there's a, here's a bunch of base camps out here, guys. We already showed you one base camp. Now Airstream also has their vans. These are the ones on the Ram chassis. Let's go over to the ones on the Mercedes. I believe they have an Atlas here also. Which this one's catching like? my eye for some reason. Because it's like, it has black on it. Yeah. The bottom half is black. You want to look in it? So this is an interstate. What do you think is catching my eye besides the black? The lights. The red light. Lights. <laughs> lights. So Mercedes chassis. This is an Interstate X uh, four-wheel drive. Let MJ go up front and see what they have. I like it already because it's they're they're make they use the limited space and its utility. I like it's, it's very like rough inside also. Stealth kind of looking. I like this. Right? Of course you would like this. No, because this makes sense because you don't have a dedicated bed. You can, like this, you can put sheetrock in yep. and two by fours and kayaks and bikes. And yep. then when you take them out, you make this into a bed. And, and it makes you a have lot of sense. all this space on both sides to store. And it feels a lot bigger than some of the other ones do. Here's your airplane bathroom, which is tiny. <laughs> I hope when I turn my mic back on that I'm You're being on. hurt. I am. You're okay, on, yeah. good. Um, this is a tiny bathroom, so why don't you go ahead of me, and then I'll open it for oh yeah. Yeah. That's that, a small that, one. I mean, we'll, we want to just... Yeah. Just for reference. I'm so about six, six foot tall. You're about six one. I'm just keep well, adding inches to me. You keep shrinking every year. Well, that's actually not too bad, but... You really can't you stand it. up straight. It's not horrible. It's not horrible. You can like, make it work. You'd have to kind of sit a little bit yeah. it's not horrible you could sit to shower but but it's a van so mm -hmm. you know and i don't know if that's a cassette or there's actual plumbing here we could see on the but outside but you'll see more of this storage space with the netting here right we have mm -hmm. little little kind of bungees which is great this is you're going to have all your here's your silver they give you silverware drawer drawers all the way across you got a lot of prep space with a two burner uh propane stove there and more um, storage here and then I'm looking yeah, it's not gonna be convection because you have the stove so and all right quickly here it's a cockpit really nicely done all leather seats or vegan leather or whatever they call it now uh, leather the pleather yeah and I, they do have these side running boards you know they dressed it up a little bit the off-road tires you have limited off-road on here but it will be Here's, good pretty is, decent this is nice in the snow okay. Big awning coming out the passenger side. So let's right, continue. Let's do a trailer. Yeah, we're getting a little low on battery here. We'll okay. continue going on to some of the bigger trailers here. I do like the bigger Airstream trailers. 
I must yeah, so say. This is probably going to be the biggest one they have yeah. here. Uh, I think that is the classic. classic. These are about 33 feet long, I believe. Somebody will jump down my throat, but double air conditioners. This is going to be, you know, the, the biggest Airstream you can get currently. What does that look like inside? It, it's nice. Is I it, mean, I'm not a big fan of the decor of this one, but it's, it's nice. Well, um, they have a nice separate bedroom. And that is an enormous kitchen, by the way. For, it's huge, huge. So you're gonna have your queen size bed in here. You're gonna have a, any light there for it? Yeah, let me try to find yeah. that here, let's see. Bed. There we go. So you have a queen size bed. There's not a lot of room. You can see as I'm uh, not a lot of room to move around. You're going to have um, a nightstand on each side. Nice as nightstand. You got a lot of storage here. Very deep storage. If the light is flickering, guys, it's just because of the light with the camera. There's a fan up above you and you do have a TV here. Then moving into the main living area, you got a booth dinette, large size booth dinette. This is very cool. I yeah. like this. Like, so look how look big it looks. So, what the, so here's what they're doing different. You remember a couple of years ago, the Airstreams were doing everything very European style, right? With the look. Now it's looking very residential style. Uh, yep. With the yep. white, the gold. This is kind of what's going on in the motorhomes. Looks much more right. homely inside. Homey. For, home, homey. Homely means you. <laughs> <laughs> That's not as good of an adjective. Um, look, deep sink here. Deep, deep sink. These. these countertops are serious they're very nice yep um there is is that, is that like a little office yes chair there yeah, I, here I you go a little here. workspace okay your tv is we do not see a tv that's probably where you would no it's a projector put, you see is projector it oh there? there i didn't even see that yeah, it's a projector and then okay. probably something comes down from behind nice. here good all right let's show the uh and then a, a very large bathroom yes, for look, a trailer. You can, you can fit in here. I mean, it's 33 feet. But so. this is a functional bathroom. Yeah, I don't I really shower. like this. I could totally dig this. Here's Cedar closet. line closet. Yeah. There's your vanity lights, shower oh, nice. lights. Now oh, I really lights. Lights. Oh, now you see the flickering here. Oh, I love the lights. Yeah. So this the is really nice, guys. There is a lot of RVs out here. I know we were just in the Newmar section. They are loaded with RVs. Everybody's is in stock, right? That you're gonna, if you come down to this show, you're going to see the RV you want, whether that's going to be a $18,000 trailer or you want a $3 million motorhome. Yeah. They have them all here, which is pretty awesome. So what, before we go, make sure to subscribe. Make sure to hit the notification bell because we're going to be bringing premieres and lives every single day. Follow us on social media, Facebook, Instagram, TikTok. And YouTube community page. Of course. And we thank you guys for joining us. We hope to see you at the show.